Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing Nightmare Catnap from Poppy Playtime. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's start off by drawing two circles for the eyes. And then another smaller circle inside each one. And then a black dot in the center. And then color the rest of the eyes in black. Next between the eyes, let's draw a small triangle for the nose. Now top underneath and let's draw the mouth. Under the nose, let's draw a curve up and out on both sides. And now another smaller curve up on the right. And a slightly longer one on the left. Now for both ends, let's curve it in. And then a long curve down towards the bottom like this. And now let's color the inside of the mouth in black. And that's it for the mouth. Now let's move up and let's start drawing the shape of the head. We'll start with a curve on top of each eye. And then a curve across in between. Now for both ends, let's continue it by curving it up and out. And then let's curve it around the mouth all the way down. And lastly for the head, let's add the ears on top. Let's draw a point up and down on the right and on the left. And then another one inside. And then let's color both of these inside triangles in black. And that's it for the head. Now let's start drawing the body. Let's start on top of the left ear and let's draw a bumpy line up and then start to curve it down like this. And then for the end, let's angle it out and curve it down. Now top back in and next to the head, let's draw a curve up, stopping here. Next, before we continue the body, let's draw the necklace. Let's draw a V-shape coming down from the head like this. And then underneath, let's draw a C-shape curve. And then another one inside. And that's it for the necklace. Now let's draw the first leg. Let's start inside the body and let's draw a curve. And then angle it down and out from both sides. Now for the end, let's draw two bumps. And a curve across inside. And now let's continue the leg going downwards with two curves. Now top back up to the top and let's continue the belly by drawing another curve over and up. And then another one underneath this one. Now for the back leg, let's draw two angles. A set of bumps again. And a curve inside. 
And again, let's bring both lines down. Now let's hop back up to the top and inside the body, let's draw a curve. And then wavy lines starting from the spine and going down. And then a few more curves on the left side. And that's it for the main part of the body. Now let's move to the ends of the legs and add the feet. At the bottom of each leg, let's draw two curves going out like this, forming a sort of heart shape. And now underneath, let's add the toes. Underneath the right leg, let's draw a scallops line down like this. Then at the bottom, let's draw a curved triangle for the toe. And then two curves inside. Now on the left side, let's draw another one in the same way, going out on an angle. And another one next to it like this. And lastly, one on the right side. And then let's color the toes in black. Now let's draw four toes in the same way on the other leg. And that's it for the first two legs. Now let's draw the next one behind. Underneath the body, let's draw two angles down like this. And then two bumps. And a curve across inside. Now underneath, let's draw two lines down behind the crescent. and then close off the bottom with two bumps. And now for the foot, let's draw a curve underneath. Then from the end, let's curve it out and back in. Now let's hop over to the right side and let's draw the other leg. Next to the right side of the head, let's draw two angles out. Then let's draw an upside down curve at the end. And then two lines down. And again, let's close off the bottom with two bumps. Now underneath, let's draw another curve. And then curve it out and back up. Now at the bottom of each foot, let's add the toes. Let's start at the end and let's draw two bumps down and out. And a curved nail at the end. And then a curve inside. Now let's draw three more toes on top in the same way, but a little bit longer.
And now let's color the toenails in black. Now let's hop over to the other leg and let's draw four toes in the same way. And that's it for all the legs and feet. Now let's add the tail on the top left. We'll start with a bumpy line going out and another one underneath. And now let's continue both of those lines by curving it up and around. And then add some curved lines inside. And that's it for Nightmare Catnap. Now let's quickly color it in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me. And please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.